Hello, welcome to the video. So it's actually like 11 o'clock now. I've been doing this thing where I don't start my videos till like late morning, but hi. I haven't eaten breakfast yet. I've been fasting kind of lately and not even like purposely. I just, I'm not like hungry. I'm just like drinking coffee in the morning and just kind of hold off. So, which is kind of good though, because then I can have, I mean, I have a lot of macros, but then I can kind of like have macros left at the end of the day, not really have to worry about not wanting to snack at night because I have the macros for it. But anyway, so I'm gonna go ahead and make, I think I'm gonna do like a burrito, but then also do like a serving of cereal because yeah, my carbs are like a little bit higher and I just feel like I'm still like in the mentality of prep, not really, but kind of where like I don't wanna have too many carbs like at once because I just, I still am like in that weird mindset of I don't have a lot when I literally have a shit ton. And then I'm stuck at the end of the day with like 80 to 100 grams and I'm like, cereal it is or like gummies or wine or something like that which i'm not complaining but i think i need to kind of do a better job of trying to have you know balanced spaced meals so anyways um i'm gonna go ahead and make a breakfast burrito and then i think i'm gonna do i'll do some frosted flakes for cereal so that's it i'll show you guys uh the finished product i hope that you guys enjoy this video and have an amazing day and that's it So apparently Anthony ate the last tortilla and we have no more left. So what I'm going to do is actually just use, I guess, like a sandwich roll. We have these French rolls. I made one in the last video for like dinner, but I'm going to do that for breakfast because we don't have tortillas. Okay, so here's the sandwich and my cereal. So I'm going to go ahead and eat this now. I'm not really sure what I have planned for the day. Honestly, I might just do a little rooftop workout um, instead of heading to the gym. So I'll keep you guys updated, but I'm gonna eat this and then I will see you in the next clip. Okay, so I actually ended up coming to the Balance office with my baby. We're visiting aunt and just kind of catching up with everybody. So probably won't film anything in there because I don't really know what's going on, but Oh, baby. That's kind of it. Um, I will keep you guys updated and see you probably back at home. All right, guys, so I'm home from the balance office now. I'm going to make, I guess, like a panini type thing um, with Joseph's flatbreads, deli turkey, cheese, and lettuce. I don't really know. It's just kind of feeling like a sandwich, but I already had that roll, so I think I'm going to do like a flatbread type thing and just like press it almost like a panini, even though I don't have a panini maker. So... That's the plan. I'll show you guys the finished product, and that's it. Apparently I don't have lettuce, so no lettuce. Um, maybe I'll just do cheese and deli jerky, and then I have guac from Chipotle, like leftover, so maybe I'll do a little bit of that on a Joseph's flatbread. So yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Currently just kind of heating up the turkey, and that's it. And then I believe I can answer them on live. So it's pretty pathetic. But the idea was there. So if I had more ingredients, I think it'd be better. Um, but anyways, this is going to be lunch super quick. And then I think I am going to get a workout um, up on the roof after this. So I will show you guys that in the next clip. So Juice is sleeping and looking like a cutie. So I'm just going to stay in here, do my workout in here. We mounted the TV on the wall, so now there's more room in the living room. So I'm just going to do it here. And I did steal it off of someone's YouTube. So I'll put the link down below. It was like some outdoor hit workout no equipment video so i'm just going to do that and hopefully it's a good one of course as soon as i get started he wants to wake up and be crazy
protein pancakes, protein banana pancakes. So I've done this before several times, but I'm gonna do level one cinnamon cookie batter and Kodiak cakes and probably about half of a banana. So I'm gonna go ahead and make this up. You guys have seen it before, but I'll show you guys the finished product and that's kind of it. So I also ended up adding some All-American nut butter to it, but this is going to be, I guess, dinner. I'm always all over the place with my meals and always eating breakfast for like different meals, but you know, it's just what I want. So gonna have this and then I will keep you guys updated on the rest of the day. So, hi. Um, I ended up finishing out the night with two Yasso bars. I did one of each flavor. I have, I think, like, black raspberry chip and, like, chocolate chip cookie dough. So I did one of each of those, and then I also did some Simply 100 calorie popcorn. Um, so yeah, just a little bit of snacking. But I did want to come on and say I have a little update for you guys in terms of the Balance Athletica launch. So the thing sold out within five minutes. We all kind of expected that with the hype that was going on. They ordered thousands and thousands more uh, product than they did for Kingdom 1.0, but it still it went. So they ended up opening up another pre-sale. So what they did for Kingdom 1.0 when it sold out, they opened up a pre-sale immediately because people were mad. Um, so they opened that up and it was basically, you placed your order unlimited amount. I mean, if you wanted to buy everything you could, if you wanted to buy one thing you could, it was whatever. Um, and they would take everyone's order and then go to the factory and give them that order, have them make it, and it would be like custom made the amount that they need type of thing. So they decided to do that again because people were very upset, um, once again that they were not able to get the Kingdom stuff. And this is actually going to be the last time that Kingdom is here. They won't be doing like a Kingdom 3.0 and they won't be bringing it back at all. So this is like the last chance if you were interested in getting some of the patterned uh, Kingdom things. Definitely, definitely do the pre-order. It does take 12 weeks to receive because like I said, they literally start from step zero um, when they give the factory the order. It literally goes into production from the start. So it takes a while to make because everything is custom made. Um, so it does take a little while, but I, it's worth it. And if you want them, this is the only chance because they are moving on to new exciting collections um, moving forward. Even I think four weeks from now is gonna be their next launch and it's gonna be something completely different. So. This is the last chance to get Kingdom. You could do 1.0 and 2.0. So if you missed out on the first one, uh, you still have the opportunity to get something from that. So that is really cool that they opened it up for both. So anything that you guys wanted from Kingdom in general, um, please be sure to grab it now because this is the last chance. And I'm telling you guys, I live in, like I can't stop wearing it. And I it sucks because they're so obvious that when you repeat. So like I'm trying to just like cycle through them all and try to make it as nonchalant as possible, but I can't stop wearing them. So yeah, that's it. And also I did um, extend my giveaway because now obviously they're opening it up um, and it's actually the pre-sale is until Monday. Monday, what's Monday? Monday the 17th um, at midnight, I believe, is the last chance uh, to place your order. So you have until then to order. If you do order through my link, um, one, thank you so much. Two, you can forward me the email at info at pagereilly.com to get entered into the giveaway. And since this kind of opens the floodgates to more people being able to buy because stock is unlimited, I made my giveaway now upgraded <laughs> to three people. So I'm gonna pick three winners instead of just one. So um, I'm gonna just probably, I don't know, pick the giveaway winner like Monday or Tuesday at that, uh, no, probably Tuesday or Wednesday. Um, so yeah, I'll keep you guys updated on that, but basically just forward me the email of your confirmation and that's it. And if you have any questions about Kingdom, um, I did do my sizing video like probably five videos ago. So if you had any questions about that, it's there. And I think that's it. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. I love you guys so much. And I will see you in the next one. Bye guys.